Hi, good morning Peter. My name is Mahira. I'm your invigilator for the OIT speaking session on the 29th of July 2023. How are you doing? Well, I'm great. Can you tell me your full name, for the record please? And what is your candidate number? Okay, and are you taking this test as a nurse? Alright. Can I see your ID, please? Thank you for the verification. Now, let's move on to the warm-up sessions. The warm-up questions are not assessed, and are a chance for us, to get used to each other's voices. We'll just talk for two to three minutes. What is the importance of the English language, in your profession? How will you greet a patient, admitted to the hospital? How will you console a patient, admitted to the hospital? How do you deal with patients from different cultures and languages? How do you deal with patients who are not comfortable sharing their personal information? Great. Thank you very much for sharing that. So, let's move on to role play now. I'll take the part of the patient, or perhaps a relative, and you'll take your professional role. The purpose of the role play is to get evidence of your ability to communicate effectively with patients. Use your ability to fulfill as much of the role play as possible. Do you have any questions? You have up to three minutes to prepare the role play. 
You will start the role play after that time. I'll let you know when the three minutes are up. You can ask me if there is anything you are not sure about, and you can make notes on the role play card if you want to. Here's a pencil for making notes. You can look at the card during the test, but you must return it to me at the end of the test. Please start preparing now. Thank you. Your preparation time is over. You can now start your role play. Don't worry if I stop you when the time is up. Yes, I am Mahira. Nice to meet you too. I am doing well, nurse. No nurse, I am completely alright, and I hope that I am recovering well. Owners, I found that I can walk even without using a walker. So, I stopped using it last evening. I hope it is a positive sign of recovery.
Yes, I know. But I had used it for three weeks. Unfortunately, I did not find any use for it. Moreover, now I can walk easily without any pain. Yes, I wish to get better, and you know, I am doing everything for that. I am doing regular exercise, and taking all my medicines on time. I feel pretty good after practicing these. So, I feel that, I don't want a walker to support me, when I walk. Yes, I understand what you are saying. But, I am not a person, who wishes to be dependent. Whenever I use the walker, I feel like, it's taking away my freedom and independence. Yes, you may please. I have been a very active man all my life. For me, using a walker is a sign of disability. Since it's been three weeks now, I thought, I had overcome the need for using a walker. Of course not. Yes, it sounds practical. All right. I suppose, I can use it for a few more weeks. Oh, no dear. Thanks for coming today, and giving me all this valuable information. Goodbye. That is the end of your OIT speaking roleplay. All the best. Thank you for watching. Please, like this video and encourage us. Subscribe and stay tuned for more videos. Kindly comment your suggestions and help us do better.